Bishop uh, Rob Mensch with us uh, today. It's a, it's a sad, sad couple of days and obviously very difficult for you. Thank you for, uh, for coming into Bolt FM and, and speaking with the community. Uh, you're welcome. Uh, I'm glad to be here and uh, try to get some, some word out to, to the community on, on, on uh, the events over the last day and a half here. It's been a pretty trying time for our community and, and, uh, and the hockey team. Well, this evening. Yeah, right. so the, the vigil service this evening uh, will take place at 7 o'clock. Yeah. And uh, if you can share rides or if you can uh, uh, carpool to get there, uh, we would appreciate that as well. Um, also, you know, it's a nice day today. It uh, wouldn't hurt maybe just to walk down to the Uniplex. Uh, we do have a lot of extra uh, seating in place um, in the curling rink. Uh, we've got overflow into Jubilee Hall. We've got overflow into, um, into the high school gym. Uh, we're trying to arrange for video feeds into those buildings as well today got people coming in to to work on that kind of stuff so um so we're hoping that we can accommodate as many people as want to come and uh, it sounds like we may have a lot of people coming mr mayor to the to the community in the coming days um my sense is it's just beginning to sink in and really once the media is gone the national spotlight and things quiet down uh later in the week and then the coming weeks uh it's going to sink in and be very difficult for people well, that's just it. You know, we've got a number of, uh, you know, uh, local kids that were involved and we've got, um, you know, families that are in, in the city here. And, uh, you know, Monday morning uh, going back into school is going to be tough uh, for some of the kids, not only in the high school, but I think in the, in the elementary schools, a lot of those young kids uh, went to a lot of the games and looked up to the players. So um, it's going to be hard for them as well. Um, we have a number of counselors that are going to be here um, uh, in the school system Monday morning. Um, you know, so I can't say enough about uh, the job that they've done um, at the Uniplex so far. And uh, tonight is going to be, uh, we've got people coming uh, to the community to help tonight as well. Extra, extra people because they know the number of people that we're expecting and uh, that are going to need some you know, somebody to talk to. And um, there was a lot of hugs given out yesterday at, down at the arena, and, uh, and uh, you know, that's where I spent most of my day because, you know, people were just gravitating towards that place. Um, um, I've been really busy um, fielding phone calls from virtually everywhere in the world. It's It's amazing, you know, the support that... People are showing towards the team. And finally, and, and, and uh, if you may, uh, would you like to say some words or, or address particularly the, the Billet families uh, Yes, today? and uh, like I say, these are parents uh, that are um, welcoming these kids into our community, into their homes. Um, you know, they are family to them. And uh, we had a couple of local kids on the team, but we had... A number of families that really considered these boys their 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 family as well. So, um, our thoughts and prayers go out to them as well as the the parents that are suffering the the loss of their actual uh, kids. So, um, I hope everybody hearing this um, stays strong. Um, you know, we we need to get together as a community tonight and. Uh, and console each other and uh, get through this.